Well, greetings from the sales floor of Ellingson Motor Cars here in Rogers, Minnesota, northern suburb of Minneapolis, Minnesota. Today we're going to talk about a 1962 Chevrolet Impala convertible. Very much the beginning of all that muscle car stuff and a big changeover, great year for Chevrolet. I'll give you all the details in but a moment. <music> Well, greetings and salutations from the sales floor of Ellingson Motor Cars here in Rogers, Minnesota, a northern suburb of Minneapolis, Minnesota. Today we're going to talk about our latest acquisition, and I'll tell you what, she's real fine, my 409, no, not quite, it's a 1962 Impala convertible. It was the beginning of the start of all this muscle car stuff. It was one of those years for Chevrolet that really was good. So you're going to want to watch this video from start to finish because we're going to give you all the details. You'll have a walk around, we'll have a cold start, give you all the details. And or you can click on the link in the description and it'll take you right to our website where we currently have over a hundred classic cars and trucks and vehicles in our inventory right now, ranging from cars from the 1920s all the way up into the 70s, 80s and beyond. So if you're looking for your first or your 100th classic collectible, odds are Ellingson Motor Cars probably has it here. Now our website is www.ellingsonmotorcars.com and that's where you'll find all of the wonderful cars we currently have in stock. It's always changing. You probably want to also sign up for our email blast because we always keep you apprised of newest and latest additions, new arrivals, and any of that important stuff that comes with watching a website on a regular basis. So anyway, let's get into the details of a really nice 1962 Impala convertible. Like I said, big year for Chevrolet. I mean, they were giving more engine options, I think is one of the biggest things that Chevrolet was doing, other than the fact completely new sheet metal from 1961 to 62. And this uh, look was with them for quite a number of years moving forward. This particular car has the 327 engine, which was now available. You could have an inline six, the 235, you could have a 283, you could have a 327. Of course, the big dad was the 409 car, but not everybody wanted that one. The little 327, like what's in this car, exceptionally nice, gives you plenty of power, whatever, hooked up with a power glide automatic transmission anybody can jump in this car and drive it. And this one has power steering as well. Take a look how nice the engine compartment is, nicely detailed all the way around. The other thing that it does have that they didn't have available, of course, in 1962 is radial tires. Radial tires are such a big improvement for all these old cars. They just ride better, handle better. Just everything about it is just really, really nice. Nope, the car is refinished in ermine white, beautiful color. Love the way that the color stripe that goes down the chrome trim matches the interior. You know, the interior on these cars, so interesting. I mean, everything was special, you know what I mean? Look at the way, you know, it's the vinyl cloth interior, all the attention to details, all the buttons, all the extra stuff. They really made cars special back in this time. And you had to special order everything. I mean, you wanted dual outside mirrors like this one. You want to have dual exhaust, you wanted to have skirts. All that stuff had to be checked off when you ordered the car. Power steering had to be checked off. Uh, the other thing that the car has, which is another interesting novelty, of course, is the dual antennas in the back. I think that's really reminiscent of this era. Lots of people like them. You know, only one of them actually is used. The other one is more for looks than anything else. Dual exhaust with the chrome tips out the back. Car has a really lovely sound. Again, why you want to watch the video from start to finish. Looking at the interior, what nice about this car, they have not modified anything to speak of. It has an original AM radio in place, all the original gauges, instrumentation. They do have an aftermarket stereo that they have nice and neatly added underneath the dash so you can listen to some of your latest tunes because, like I said, FM radio wasn't even something to be had in 1962. White, black convertible top goes up with a mere pull of a button, top goes up, so if you happen to go out in a day when it's raining, hey, there you go, you know, you can put the top up and you're going to be just fine. 
you know, I, like I said, I just, they, these cars were so distinctive. Everything about them was just really unique. Now, you could order it as an Impala. You could order it as an SS trim package. It was $54 for the trim package. But uh, this one, like I said, has a 327. More than enough power for anyone to jump in this car and drive her down the road, without a doubt. Now, you can find all of our stuff on Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, and now TikTok as well. Leave us a comment. Give us a like. Give us a subscribe. I mean, all those things are things that you can do that you can get the information on this car, our current inventory, and as an added bonus, some of the cars we've sold over the last several years as well. So you can find stuff if you're on the internet, perusing through. Take a look at those sites. There's always fun stuff to do. Well, I guess I'm looking at this car saying, you know, it's really nice. I love the video. I like all this stuff, all the details, but I want to come and look at it in person. I I'm kind of one of those guys. I got to have a hands-on approach. Got it. I'm kind of the same way. Well, we are open to the public Monday through Friday from 10 to 5 and Saturdays 10 to 4 as well. So if you want to come down, take a look at it, make sure everything's good as advertised, sit in it, whatever you need to do, we're here to help you. You can also pick up the phone, give me a call at 763-428-7337 and I am here to answer any and all questions you may have about this car or any of our inventory as well. Now, you say, you know, but I live out of state. I mean, how do I get the car to me? That's no problem. We ship cars all over the United States and for that matter, all over the world. So we can help you get that arranged as well. Financing, we can lead you in several different directions with people that actually help finance all these collector vehicles and they can always lend you a hand because they understand what they are. I guess it's, it's one of those things in this day and age, a lot of us want to go back to our youth, think about cars that we had in the past, cars we heard about, whatever. We want something that you know, is tangible, you can touch, you can look at your 401k or IRAs or whatever. What's more fun than actually having a car in your garage that you can go out, touch, put a little wax on, cruise the neighborhood and get the thumbs up from everybody. So. Uh, take a look at uh, our website again if you have any interest in any of our cars. All the information is right there. And our website again is ellingsonmotorcars.com. And we thank you again for watching our videos and hope to see you down the road soon. Take care.